fact, when you get a property like this, this is the kind of property that the investors who don't want to have their lives subjected to some of that drama, this is the kind of property you guys buy, all right? I got started in the real estate business by doing a house hack in the city of Parma, right? I was, I've talked about this many times. I was 21 years old, making $30,000 a year working at a radio shack. I bought my first house in the city of Parma where this property is located, right? You could do a house hack, right? You could live in one of the units and then have a tenant living in your other unit who's probably going to be pretty drama free because uh, in a neighborhood like this, the base of tenants, you know, they're reasonable tenants. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sales Show. Folks, thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. Y'all are looking for a safe, low, low risk investment property. This is the one y'all want. 2327 Brookview Boulevard, Parma, right? If any of y'all have been paying attention to what we've been doing on Holton Wise TV for the last decade, you are probably familiar with the ultimate guide to grading Cleveland neighborhoods. If not, don't worry, it's linked below. You'll see on the guide, Parma is rated higher which is less risky than a majority of the rental properties you guys are buying out here in Ohio, right? You're going to see a lot of stuff in Ohio in like the D or C grade areas with a lot of Section 8 and, you know, all the trials and tribulations that come along with that, right? A lot of you who watch Holton Weiss TV, you know, the majority of you are not buying properties from us. The majority of you are just indulging in our glorious Tenants from Hell content, right? Those are our like by far our most popular videos. The majority of the stuff you see on those videos, guys, is going to come from like C, D, and F grade properties. When you get a property like this, this is the kind of property that the investors who don't want to have their lives subjected to some of that drama. This is the kind of property you guys buy, all right? Now, the rent's much higher, right? 1100 bucks a month is going to be your market rent, right? So you'll be able to pull down $2,200 a month, but... Perhaps even more important than that, not just the fact that the rents are a little bit higher in a neighborhood like this, the drama factor. It's just so much lower. Also, thinking about other things, right? Myself, personally, I got started in the real estate business by doing a house hack in the city of Parma, right? I was, I've talked about this many times. I was 21 years old, making $30,000 a year working at a radio shack. I bought my first house in the city of Parma where this property is located, right? Skip. You know, smash cut. I'm 36 years old. I've sold over $200 million worth of real estate. We work all through the state of Ohio, right? But the whole thing, the whole Holton Wise empire, so to speak, right? Before we were in Cincinnati, Columbus, Toledo, Dayton, before we had thousands of rental properties, before we did $200 million in sales, all of it started with me pulling off a house hack in Parma, Ohio. So this would be another one. You could do a house hack, right? You could live in one of the units and then have a tenant living in your other unit who's probably going to be pretty drama-free because uh, in a neighborhood like this, the base of tenants, you know, they're reasonable tenants. You get high credit scores, credit scores above 700, uh, very infrequent evictions. Uh, you get a lot of, you know, just solid, solid tenants in these types of neighborhoods, right? So this is going to work out really good for investors who want the long-term cash flow without the additional risks could also work great for those house hackers, people who want to get started in the game, buy the property for two fifty nine nine, only put down three and a half percent, and then go ahead and have that tenant pay for your rent or pay for your mortgage with their rent while you live for free. That, folks, is how I started in the game, and it's worked out quite well for me, right? So from here, if you guys want to tour the property or submit an offer, just shoot us an email, sales at holtonwise.com. If you want to tour the property, hit us up before 5 o'clock. We'll get you in there before the end of the day. If it's after five, we'll probably get you in there the very next day. If you want to do an offer, just have your proof of funds or pre-approval letter with the amount of money you want to offer ready to send to us at Sales at Holton Wise. If you need financing, if you want to buy it, but you don't have the money, but you need the money, don't you worry, y'all. We have financing for you. I know a lot of you guys are getting crushed by the high interest rates out there. Well, we work with a ton of different investor lenders who focus on you guys. They understand that the cash flow numbers need to work. The property's got to pencil out, and they don't mind if you're out of state or even if you're out of the country, right? So we do specialize in setting you guys up with the right kind of financing to make these assets cash flow producing assets. Send us an email, sales at HoltonWise.com, and we will get you hooked up with those lenders. Let's go.
Nice. Beautiful brick house, baby. Everything looks real nice outside. iron gate there. It's kind of nice. Looks real nice on the outside. That's good. Tops. Love to see it. Oh yeah. Bathroom just refinished. Tub was just redone. That's not making the video. Nobody gives a shit about the toilet. Most of this shit doesn't make it into the video anyway.
<laughs> oh, it is a breaker. No, no. Oh, my bad. There you go. No, I thought this was a. I thought it was fuses. Not bright enough. Oh, blue bathroom. That's cool. Another recently refinished tub. Older medicine cabinet. Closet. Breaker. Which would be helpful if you could see. Oh, you bitch, you want to close. thing has baseboard heat. This front door again because I think it's a mock so. Yep. Two 
to the basement. I've definitely never been down here, but they're individually labeled. Oh, wow, okay. And they're nice and sectioned off, too. That is cool. A water tank. Furnace just got checked. Yeah, it's actually really cool. Yeah. That looks, looks really good. And then this is a down unit one. in appearance breaker. Yeah, I did that one first. Oh look, a little doggy door. Interesting. Did you turn the parts on or there's something? I didn't turn any on. I feel like maybe maybe this one. The uh, hall one that you can't you can only see through the door? Yeah. yeah. Really any realtors will come in and this one. They'll be able to see. Yeah. Yeah, but it's a brick. Right, I can really do this. He's hearing that. He heard you say, drill right into a fucking tree. Well, I mean, fence is the next best thing, right? Spindles and shit. It's a nice, nice fence. Nice fence, could use a sign. Could use a sign. It's the weird thing about fences. Put them, no? My little hillbilly dude that didn't do shit. 
It like fell apart in the car. Yeah, I don't know what it is about this gimbal, but certain days it runs super hot like today. It's barely warm, and we've been filming for almost 20 minutes. Yeah, and dude, when I was at Del Mar, it like got better the longer I filmed. Yeah, it's weird. It didn't make any fucking sense. I mean, it's definitely a little warm around the gears, but... But it's not acting all goofy like it did in Canton when we got to that last one. It was like... Well, yeah, it, dude, at, uh, at Del Mar, it was doing this shit. Dude, this is a beautiful house. I know. I would buy this. One. Yeah, I would definitely. But they probably want, you know. It's out of uh, it's out of our initial price range, I think. Yeah. You think right here. Yeah, it looks good to me. Make it crooked. <laughs> as crooked as you can. Fucking sideways, upside down. Did you bring screws? Yeah. I'm just, oh. I'm just this is probably the best spot. Yeah, because you can see it from the stop sign over there. Yeah. Oh, this is going to stick right through, though. This screws are huge. It's fine. That's why you get homeowners insurance. For people drilling signs into your fence. Just don't be smacking into this fence. I want to make a joke about that motorcycle club right now, <laughs> but I think it's best not to do that. Yeah, I'd rather not poke the bear. Yeah, I mean, there's a chance that they would recognize the only two white people they've ever <laughs> yeah, seen in their entire lives. I'm sure they're gonna know. <laughs> They'll know it was us. You're like that kid behind the camera was an asshole. Yeah, dude, I left you alone in there with the yeah. like a new SD card. What an asshole, dude! I could have got murdered now. Now that I know how violent they are. Oh, fuck, I'm not wearing the hoodie. <gasps> I didn't expect to be on camera today, so. I wore mine, but my my badge is worn off. <laughs> it's, now it's just a black hoodie. It's just a black hoodie. And you can kind of make out the the logo on the back of it. That's cool. Yeah, fuck, I should have thrown on a goddamn, goddamn hoodie before I screwed that in. No, that's okay, dude. They won't film it. They won't air any of this because it's not good. That's true. Yeah. I guess I could take solace in that. That's the problem with filming stuff in Parma. It's all nice and shit. And yeah, this is not our MO. What, what, am I, what jokes am I Here's supposed to make? Here's a well-maintained house that's in good condition. <laughs> what, what jokes can I make about your property when it's, it's, yeah, it's fucking like, beautiful? You yeah, should buy this. You should. <laughs> when we film shit that I would buy, I'm like, this video is going to suck. This video is going to suck. There's nothing of substance here. Sorry, guys. This is no blooper reel, really, I guess. They wanted to get this one. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.